Well, hey guys, welcome to the channel. I'm glad you're stopping by. Two videos in one day, right? Two videos in one day. It's probably not going to be one of those videos I get a lot of views on, but it's okay. Um, but this is kind of for you guys, kind of giving an update on the channel and where we're going from here. So, we're near... It's my chair. It's, again, that's me being big guy. But <laughs> that's part of the video. Part of the video. There we go. Uh, my chair. It's not a fart. I wish it was because it'd be kind of like farting and like on demand. Would that would that be disgusting? Maybe I don't know. So I wanted to talk about some things that's going on with the channel that. Uh, I'd like to do now. Um, the channel's been growing, which is great. Um, there's been a slowdown, which uh, I was kind of hoping to hit 3,000 by the end of the year. Um, it may and may not be possible. We still have maybe uh, a month and a half left to go, so there's a good possibility that you know we might hit uh, 3,000 by then. Uh, I don't want to say it's going to happen because uh, sometimes you put goals up and you set yourself up for failure. But I want to hit the goal eventually. So eventually I want to hit 3,000 followers. Um, you know, way, one way we're going to do that is if we uh, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, uh, share, and, you know, start doing streaming more, um, you know, making new friends. You know, I, I'd love to get on with Fire Demon eventually. Uh, ten, tonight I'm going to try to get on with Legicator. And I'd like to get on with a lot of people like Mass Hole, uh, um, Team Skeptic, Blue Bacon, um, and there's several, there's several, not just a Bridge of the Divide, Sovereign Soul, um, you know, sometimes I, I've been on um, Ironton Auditors, um, but you know, there's a whole lot more, a whole lot more, and I don't want to, like, sit here all day and list the people I'd like to get on with, because there's a lot of people I'd love to get on with, um, um, Dog Detect, is it Dog Detective? Um, uh, Isa, um, oh my god, I'm gonna get murdered for not remembering. My memory sucks, by the way. Uh, that's what years of psych meds do to you. Uh, <laughs> lots of psych meds. Um, yeah, I, and the, the camera shake. We gotta figure that out. We gotta figure out a way to fix that because it's starting to look like Cloverfield whenever I'm filming. Uh, if you haven't watched Cloverfield, I'd highly recommend it. But, anyways, uh, there's some things I've dropped the ball on quite a bit, and uh, I've talked about this a lot. Um, you know, I, I stepped on the scale this morning. Um, after I ate, which I, you shouldn't step on the scale after you wake up in the morning and eat and drink, uh, and I was setting at 316, uh, which is, you know, let's get a timeline. I was almost 390 pounds a couple years ago. I was a big guy. I'm still a big guy. I'm always going to be a big guy. Um, and, you know, I started the boxing thing. And I got into it. And I got into going to the gym almost every day. Um, going to train with Chad from time to time. Um, setting goals, what I wanted to do. Uh, and lately, for the last month and a half or so, well, prior, yeah, I mean, it's it's been a while. It's been a while, um, maybe since late September, since I've really been pushing myself, and I haven't been. You know, I, I've, I've maybe a couple times last week I went into my room, one of our rooms, and uh, I, I was using the heavy bag for a few minutes. But that's not cutting it. It's not cutting it. You know, I'm not going to the gym. And here I am, I'm a diabetic who figured, right? Uh, and I got heart problems. People, you know, like me, uh, you know, I was born with heart issues. Uh, my family, a lot of us have uh, diabetes, heart disease, uh, the cancer, um, everything you can think of, we've got. Uh, mental issues, depression, uh, you name it, we've got it. And it, it, my, and it, you know, I kind of born with these things and it was eventually going to happen. But the diabetes is getting to the point now where I'm waking up in the middle of the night screaming, crying um, cause of my feet. Uh, I, ne I, don't, I never experienced this, right? I, you know, last night I was asleep and I woke up um, hurting. My God, I was hurting. Um, 
on my feet and you know the only thing i could do was take some motrin and uh rub my my wife um rubbed some kind of ointment on my toes which may or may not be i i can't say it on the internet i don't want to get in trouble don't want to get in trouble but it may not be legal i i, I guess <laughs> anyways um yeah it's getting bad it's getting bad um uh, I I never heard the dangers of of your feet and stuff like that and your toes and all that stuff hurting and it does it sucks so I need to turn around guys really bad really bad I, and I can't blame anybody except for myself right it's, and this I, you know people said people told me they say hey you're gonna fail at this and I did I failed I dropped out. I stopped boxing, I stopped eating right, started eating junk again, um, sugary stuff, my sugar's been going up, blood pressure's gone up, constant headaches, mental health stuff, and I shouldn't be, this, is, this has been a great year, one of the best years of my life, one of the greatest days of my life just happened about two weeks ago, uh, you know, I got to marry Miss Bits and it was amazing, um, and this year's been amazing, best year ever. In a long time. Um, and, you know, I finally got insurance. And I come to find out that uh, my insurance doesn't cover my insulin. Which is not good. Not a good problem to have. So i got to figure that out. I've got like four doses left. Because I take mine weekly. Um, it's called Trilicity. And I guess my insurance is like, nope, we're not paying for that. Um, which I don't know how insurance doesn't cover insulin. Which... I guess that's a problem with, uh, you know, the medical, is it medical system? I don't know. Big Pharma, is that right? Uh, yeah, that's a problem. It's a big, big problem. But I need to get to the point where, you know, I need to get back on the scale and start seeing rolling back in time. You know, my ideal way to be 230. Um, I'm always going to be a big guy. And I want to post a video later this week. I, I, I found some videos from 15 years ago. You know, I started looking back on YouTube and I checked my old channel. 15 years ago, I posted some videos on a different channel. And I'm going to pull those in so you can see them. So I've been on YouTube for 15 years um, in some type of capacity. And is that crazy? Is that crazy? I mean, and I know some people are going to say, well, that's sad. You should have so many followers which just because you're on youtube doesn't mean you're going to get seen like uh it's, it's almost like being a rock star you can have the best music in the world and have all kinds of fans but it doesn't mean somebody's going to see you um which that's the thing is is just there's a lot of competition in youtube and uh, these videos are cringe absolute cringe but i'd like to see what let you guys see uh, how I was 15 years ago, how how I was, I was a small guy, I was smaller, I was big, but I, you know, I was a small guy compared to what I am now, um, but I need to get back to eating right, one, I, I can't keep on eating junk, you know, as much, you know, we got Thanksgiving and Christmas coming up, so here we are, we got cake and turkey and stuffing, you know, everything the fat people like we're getting especially if you live in ohio uh well southern ohio where i live where i live um we're all about that being baptist and eating fried chicken and handshakes that's kind of how we are here like that's what it is um but yeah i need to really fix myself before i lose some toes uh or lose my life because uh diabetes is not good heart disease isn't good and, you know, I, I get people all the time and it calls me fat and all this stuff, which, yeah, I mean, it bothers me somewhat because I know I'm fat, but it kind of helps me a little bit um, because I, I know what it is. You're, you're attacking the most obvious thing about me. Uh, the only other obvious thing you could say is like, oh, you're, you're batshit crazy. You have mental issues. And I'm very open about that. Um, but I need to get back on the train, guys. I really do. I need to get back. I need to start streaming again. Um, you know, I'd like to get back to my old hobbies. I started playing game. I started gaming again. 
uh, a little bit more uh, than I used to. You know, there's just so much going on. Like, it's been stressful at work. Um, everything's been so stressful lately with just the stuff that's going on in my life. And, you know, keeping up with the YouTube channel. I want to. Tr trust me, I want to stay on top of this YouTube thing. I love it. Absolutely love it. You know, if I'm putting out two videos a week uh, and maybe two streams a week, that would be ideal. Um, you know, I'd love for, you know, a couple years from now if a social blade is like, hey, you're going to hit 200 some thousand subscribers. Uh, holy shit. Could you imagine that? Could you imagine uh, this small channel after 15 years hitting in the hundreds of thousands? Like, holy cow be amazing uh one of those uh, dream come trues but uh you know social blade you know they kind of take a look at your growth how it's going um and they kind of see you know if you stay on that trend uh this is what it will be in like five years and like it says five years it'd be up to two hundred seven thousand followers which would be amazing don't get me wrong i'm not saying it's impossible everything's possible um but i like to improve these friendships with uh some of these other channels, uh, not just to help my channel, but to help them grow. Uh, you know, I miss my friends. I miss my friends a lot, my my, my friends. Um, and, you know, I kind of walked away because, you know, I'm stupid. I'm, I'm kind of dumb. I walk away from people uh, because I, I was always afraid to let my problems mesh in with their theirs. And I have some friends that see me now and they think that my political beliefs uh, are bad for some reason, which I don't understand. I, you know, I could talk about my political stuff and, um, you know, I, I consider myself pretty progressive for the most part. Um, I'm not a Democrat and I'm not a Republican. Uh, I guess you would call me libertarian, I guess. But some, some, some of my friends think that, hey, you're you're a you're a bigot or something like well i don't even where you even get that like from watching any of my videos and i've you know i've had that i'm like really really you really think that like i i you know if something if you guys want to hear things about um political stuff i'm open to talk about it but i don't want to lose a lot of subscribers and uh go down the political arena I don't like that because, um, uh, you know, you can lose a lot of friends when it comes to religion and politics. Um, and here's my little girl. There's my little girl. There's my little girl. Uh, but you, you can lose a lot of friends uh, talking about that stuff. And you can lose because uh, there's no right way to be. There's no right uh, political uh party to be on there's not and i figured me playing pan in the middle would be the great idea but you know i'd still have people it's like oh you suck you're you don't believe in what i believe in uh your 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 beliefs aren't tied as close to mine as i don't want to i want to be myself uh i want to be me i want to make my own decisions i don't want uh fucking selena gomez or uh jimmy kimmel or uh Tucker Carlson or anybody to tell me, hey, you need to believe this. I, I don't want any of that shit. I don't care. Like, I, I look on both sides and I'm like, well, there's good ideas there. And there's a good ideas there. I I don't know what else to say. Don't know what, I, I don't know what else to say, but yeah. But I need to get back into streaming. I need to get back into the health stuff. Um, I need to get back into making videos again. Get back into gaming. Uh, get back into ma building the best life I could possibly build with my wife um, and my family and my friends. And it's kind of hard just to really put things together. And it sucks because I've never really been good at putting things together. You guys just mean a lot to me, believe it or not. I know we might not know each other on a personal level. Some of us I do know on a personal level I've met. Um, even if it's just once in passing, um, you know, I kind of feel like maybe I, 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 I got to make new friends, which is great. We all need friends. Even Chili needs friends, which 
Fuck you, Chili. That was, that was mean. But uh, before I keep on rambling and making this a 20-minute long video, uh, I, I just want to say I love you very much. Um, we're going to get there eventually. We're going to get back to where we was. We're going to do the streams. We're going to have a lot of fun. Hopefully, maybe next year about this time, if I do the right thing, maybe I'll be half the size I am now. It'd be amazing. Well, not half. And maybe, I don't know, I guess. You know, it's better than being almost 400 pounds, that's for sure. But I don't want to hurt anymore. I don't want to be sick anymore. Um, I just want to be me. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Definitely appreciate it, and I'll see you soon. Oh.